של... Ramadan. Guys and girls, you know, you've seen it all. We have tried good if there's, we've tried bad if there's, we've tried cheap if there's, but we have never, ever tried an iftar meal for 10,000 taka. So today we got invited to the good old Sheraton Hotel in Dhaka and today we are here to find out what it's like and if it's really worth it. Look at this little fancy fireball. <laughs> and guess who's there? Sabir. Hello eh? everyone. Are you ready for the 10,000 taka iftar meal? It's basically 11,000. 10,990 taka. Ah, really? <laughs> yes. And right. we're gonna meet Sarah. She's from the marketing team yes. from Sheraton. She's going to show us around a little bit. And then afterwards, obviously, we get everything we can yeah. and we'll eat it. And then we find out is it worth those 11,000 taka? Eh? Let's see. Stay Whew. with us. Hello. Welcome to the largest all-day dining restaurant in Dhaka, oh. in Bangladesh actually, not just Dhaka. <laughs> okay, and you're gonna show us around a little bit, right? Yes. For now. Yes. So, but if there is starting soon? Yes, it will start in 40 minutes. So 40 minutes. So, okay. We should get started. Okay, I follow you. Beef prime ribs. So the chef is preparing beef prime ribs. It is Sheraton Dhaka, authentic. Anytime you come here, you will find a beef prime rib. And it's the most delicious dish here. These are the two western counters where you can find the main dishes such as lamb shank, uh, chicken pandi, lamb uzi, whatever we are serving on the day. The signature dishes of that day will be served here. You've been to Puran Dhaka, I've seen in your vlogs. Of course, but here it's a little different than Puran Dhaka. This is different, but... Not so crazy. <laughs> <laughs> but we're doing a few Puran Dhaka authentic dishes such as beef chuti kebab, beef chaat. I'm sure you're gonna. So you got the good taste from old Dhaka, but uh, you left the craziness there. Yes, this is the whole kebab section. It's beef chaat. Mm. This is Adana kebab. So this is made by one of our own Turkish chef who is from Turkey. His oh. specialty is making kebabs. He makes kebabs all day. <laughs> These are all iftar delights. If you would be here the first time, and how would you start your iftar? Where would you go first? First kebab? <laughs> first kebab. I would not <laughs> touch any iftar delights. I would rather go into kebabs as you go into the so, time ribs. So before you start light, you'll be like, nah, whatever. Give me the kebab, give yes. me the birani or give me whatever, give right me the ribs. the main dish. <laughs> no starters. So we have three types of halim. We have beef halim, mutton halim, we also have a Hyderabadi halim and we have mutton nihari. This is my favorite. Mm -hmm. If you want to try, I would really really suggest try the mutton halim and the mutton nihari. It's excellent. Yeah, no worries, we will try everything. So, we didn't eat for the whole day. Of course, uh, I miss Seri as always, so I'm ready for everything. Then we have our live sushi and sashimi. You can find different type of assorted sushi and sashimis here. This is the Asian corner where you can find, you can make your own Show is Hilsha uh, Fry. Oh. So we serve Hilsha Fry every single day. So much food, so much different types of food. It's and not possible to eat everything. You have to try everything. Okay, okay, okay. But then you probably have to carry me out of here. That's not a problem. Maybe I cannot we'll walk enter. anymore. We, we have wheelchairs, don't worry. Okay, perfect. <laughs> 
as and per uh, our religion, we must start with a date and then anything else. Okay, I will do that, but not too many dates because then you're not. Yeah, it, it's it's gonna fill you up. One little date and then ready. And we have 14 types of juices, so whatever suits you, you can try it from there. I think I'll find one. Yeah. <laughs> I'm already exhausted. I've been to the kitchen. <laughs> That's why I look like this. I made some shots and while I did some shots in the kitchen, Sabri are already getting the food. So our table already looks pretty nice. And you guessed, you don't know how hectic it is. As everybody eats at the same time, I wouldn't say it's chaos, but everybody's so hyped, everybody's rushing to the buffet to get all the food. So yeah, our goal for today is to uh, try everything. Basically, every item possible. <laughs> what time is it, by the way? We cannot eat already? Not yet. Really? A few minutes left for iftar. Oh, it's 10 minutes yes. past 6. Probably four to five minutes. That's so funny, everybody is sitting at their tables, but then nobody's eating. <laughs> it's really funny how everybody has like fully packed tables and nobody's eating. <laughs> you have a perfect table, huh? Yeah. Oh my god, you got basically everything, huh? <laughs> People are still waiting, nobody's eating. <laughs> this is the fullest table I've ever seen with food. <laughs> Okay, there was a sound playing and now it's off and everybody's starting. We made it. Happy Iftar. Happy Iftar. Work smart, not hard. It was so busy and now everybody's sitting on the table. Obviously now is the best time to get your food. The kebab looks really nice. I think today is a non-vegan day. Also look at this. <laughs> this is a massive bowl. Lump shank. Bangladeshis apparently love that, but I don't know. Bro, when are we finished? Still couldn't finish, you know? Look at this table. Yeah, it looks... Soon we have everything, right? Yeah, inshallah. Inshallah. Happy Easter, man. Yeah, thank you. Is now it's finally time? Easter time, eh? Yes, Allah ma Iqbal. Chef Allah ma Iqbal. You taking care of the fish, eh? Yeah. Oh All my right. God. I'm Mahmoud. Fast breaking yeah, time. Mmm. Bangladeshis love fried food, eh? Yes. <laughs> what do you uh, make? We are making the pizza and pita bread is our pizza. specialty. Yes. Oh, but where is the pizza? I didn't see pizza. Yeah, pizza after that seven is coming. Uh, after that pizza? Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. It never stops. Yeah, it never stops. But you make really good pasta. Huh? Thank you. Thanks I so much. I saw you're a really good <laughs> pasta chef. You from Italy? No, I'm from the Dubai. Actually. Sabri did the best job of getting all the food ready. Happy Easter. Classic buttermilk sugar. Mmm. Really nice. And now we go for like prawn tempura. Prawn tempura. Mmm. It's so good. Get the massive jumbo prawn. <laughs> what is this? That's mutton leg. The mutton leg, eh? Yeah. Bangladeshis love it. Bangladeshis, Pakistanis, Indians, everywhere. Here okay, we got the salmon. Yeah, it's very nice. Okay, here's your fish. Jatiomach, the national fish. Okay, so I made myself a super random plate. Mutton birani, eh? The mani. Mix it with the tomatoes and the cucumber. Mmm. Just look at the fluffy dessert. Mmm. Too good, man. When I finish this, we go get some sushi. If I look at the sushi, it looks very good. <laughs> You know me, I'm an idiot. I always rush in the kitchen without wearing this. So if you're the boss of those chefs, don't get mad at them. They do their job really good. Everybody's super nice, everybody's super friendly. Everybody really cooks very well. And everybody tells me to wear this, so <laughs> no worries. Whenever I tell you something about birani or other beef kinds, <laughs> don't trust me because I have no idea. But I eat a lot of sushi. Spicy man. Nobody told us that uh, spicy tuna is spicy man. Be careful. What is this? This mutton halim. Mm. Seems like my mom made it. It's that good. Okay, I also try. It's really good. I never tried it in my life really. My mom never made this so I don't know if it tastes like my mom would do it. But it's really nice. I'm so full already. But I want some soup. It looks like ramen soup from the Asian corner. You can choose whatever ingredients you want. 
and you get a fresh little soup. Spicy and non spicy. 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 Yeah, man. Man. Thank you. Welcome. Mm. Soup is so good. It's like a ramen. You have to be literally a monster to eat everything. The food is absolutely delicious. I love their juice corner a lot. I have taken a lot of juice together today. But yeah, there are other more items which I couldn't explore because my tummy is full. But yes, if you can eat all you want, please come here and I will definitely recommend this place. Oh, and Sabri told me you don't have to be finished by 8 or something, so you can stay here till 11. Basically, if you do it very smart, you eat for 30 minutes, then rest. Eat, rest. So good, the soup. But so spicy. Ah, uh, <laughs> Bro, what do you think? It was pretty nice, huh? Eh? Uh, it was really nice. No, we tried to eat everything. Obviously, we couldn't show everything on the camera, but when the camera was turned off, maybe I got lost at the chocolate fountain. <laughs> 10,990 taka. 10,090 taka. You think it's worth it? Uh, if you apply, buy one, get one, and considering the food, I uh, I believe it's worth it. Oh yeah, there are some uh, discounts, right? Yes. If you have like specific visa cards or whatever, you can get a little bit cheaper. You can decide if it's worth it or not, but I liked it. <laughs> yeah, we had a very pleasant experience. Yeah, it was really good, to be honest. Oh, good meat, huh? What is this? For you, for a seri, huh? Seri. Seri, maybe, huh? Oh, food. Sweet, huh? Sweet. Do you like sweet? I oh, like sweet. No problem. Gatekeeper also happy. Everybody can go to bed now. Full and happy. <laughs>